Fallout 76, baby. You know, this is a game that started off rough. Didn't have a lot to do in it. Got really bad reviews. Just was a disaster at launch. But they didn't give up on it. The developers didn't give up on it. And they kept developing content for it. And I think they effectively have fixed the game. And now I want to go through and experience the story of Fallout 76. Now, if you don't know, it is a multiplayer game, but it can be played at a single player level. You don't have to do any of the multiplayer events if you don't want to. You can just stick to the story and just play that way. Um, I don't recommend it, but um, you can certainly do that. I'm going to do some of that um, through this playthrough because I want to experience the story. So let's dive in to Fallout 76. So we're going to do a new character. I'm going to start from the very beginning, level one, and go from there. accepted that armed conflict was the only way to preserve our rights to life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. If our founding fathers could only see us now. From Antietam to Amiens, Okinawa to Anchorage, we have fought. And now, the Red Menace is at our doorstep. Democracy itself is under threat of annihilation. That is why today, July 4th, 2076, 300 years after our great nation began, we gather together to honor the completion of Vault 76. This sprawling underground shelter may have been engineered by Vault Tech, but it was built by you, the good people of America. So that if the bombs do come, if the end does come, our way of life will endure. But not everyone will be saved. Those chosen to enter this vault must be our best and our brightest. For when the fighting has stopped and the fallout has settled, you must rebuild. Not just walls, not just buildings, but hearts and minds, and ultimately, America itself. So as we stand here today, we pray that the world will know peace. But if that is not our destiny, if war must come, we stand together knowing that here in Vault 76, our future begins. <laughs> Oops. Yes. Okay. We're done. And we'll name him J. Keep it simple. Let's get a good pose. <laughs> uh, yeah, right. Arr, arr. Get it, Vault Boy. <laughs> I 
<laughs> That's it. There's our boy. Happy Reclamation Day. Today's the day, everyone. Reclamation Day. We've been preparing for this moment for 25 years. We're ready. You're ready. America is waiting for us, so let's get out there. The Overseer. All right. Okay. Grab our pit boy. Okay. Oh, it's a little game. It's a little mini game. What am I supposed to do? Oh, okay. I see. trophy for it that's cool you have been tasked with nothing less than the rebuilding of America such a huge responsibility just know that vault tech is proud of you I stay am proud of you stay hydrated when you hear this, it means I've been gone for several hours. I've got my own mission. Her own mission. Out there in Appalachia. If you get this is the overseer. You will signing off. Make use of stim packs. They are the message repeats in twenty-four hours. So, about the system I suspect. There isn't any. <laughs> Keep it on moving. For our camp. Pop! Come on. Pop the balloon. There. Yeah. Yeah, reclamation day. Pop! I can't pop those. What about these? Ah ha ha! Reclamation Day? Uh, reclaiming Appalachia? Never too yeah, late. Yeah, 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 yeah. After I pop this balloon. Oh, my glasses, I can see now. Never stop learning. Be the best that you can be. Find friends. All make you ones. Okay. Discover the Overseer's mission. Overseer's log, or should I say, direct communication. Because whoever is listening to this had the moxie to try to find out where I've gone. But I'm glad you did. Truth is, I need your help. I've been given a task and I've decided to break protocol and tell you what it is. Because if there's one thing I've learned in these past few years, it's that we need to rely on each other. There were three active nuclear silos in Appalachia before the bombs fell. They blew up the world before. We can't let it happen again. So we've got to locate and secure all of the silos. Okay. Or die trying. Hopefully the former. But it's been 25 years. 
I just don't know what we're gonna find out there. Or where to start. My directive was to go to the nearest population center and assess the situation. I'll set up a camp on the way once I get my bearings. Find me there. Okay. So, essentially she has gone off on her own mission and we're going to join her on it. Fresh Dweller. And let's see here. Starts out with the Slugger Perk card. Grants 10% damage to your two-handed weapons. Uh, I'm not going to use two-handed weapons too much early on. At least I shouldn't. Let's out with the first aid person. Let's, let's do that. Because I'll use less... I'll use less stim packs early on, which is good because in this game you start off with some, but you don't get a lot. Um, they become plentiful further in the game, but to start off, yeah, I think this is the better route to go. Um, yeah, let's do that. Sir, those young ladies down there, they seem exceedingly alive. <laughs> they haven't what yet that made mean? any untoward advances, but perhaps you could speak to them? Verify their intentions are civil? I can do that. Any idea what those two are doing up here? Only that they appear to have some vested interest in accessing the vault. One seemed quite perturbed when I told them that wouldn't be happening. But I'm not sure if she believed me. You sound like you think they're up to something. I've been keeping watch here long enough to have learned that outside the vault, people don't always have one's best intentions at heart. I'm sorry to say it. But it's the truth. Okay. What's been going on out here? Until quite recently, it's been exceedingly peaceful. I maintained my post, greeted latecomers out of the vault, and otherwise reveled in Appalachia's natural splendor. But very recently, it seems people have come back to Appalachia. Those two and more to boot. The non-vault sort, you understand. It's all very concerning. Who knows what they might be up to? Have you seen the Overseer? Well, yes, but it's been some time. But she was a resourceful woman. I, I'm, I'm sure she's all right. All right. I ought to be well, on my do way. Be careful out there, sir. Be a way in there. Maybe. Wait, a vault dweller? Hey there! Hello. Whoa, whoa. Just a friend here, not a threat. Just had some questions for you. You came out of the vault, right? I thought it was empty. Wait, is the door still open? The door is sealed tight. No one's getting in. God damn it. <gasps> we got a tip from the wayward. Heard of the place? New bar down the road. So this guy told us that... After you gave him the last of our caps? And he said that inside that vault is the... You know, that's where the big one is. Our last chance to turn our lousy luck around. Uh... Ooh, this is where I can have some fun. 
Um. <laughs> uh, lie. Wait, what? He's jerking you around, Lacey. Face it. We got scammed. But those were the last of our caps. No. Someone has to know something. We're just gonna stick it out until we find them. Wonderful. <laughs> Look, thanks for whatever. Now, You're welcome. unless there was something you needed? Why, yes, actually. They didn't give you a weapon. I guess I've got something I could spare. Here. A machete. Thank you. I better be mm -hmm. going. Bye. Goodbye. Let's go ahead and equip the uh, machete because. Like any Fallout game, ammo is scarce. Um, until you get to the end game content, and then ammo is much more plentiful. But for now, we're just going to kill these ghouls with the machete. It wants us to go to the Wayward to take a look at our map. So we're starting here. And if we go straight, we actually hit a daily um, mission or quest. Da daily quest, I'll just call them. So let's go do that. Let's have some fun. Weak feral ghoul. Let's see if I can chop your head off. There we go. Little bastards. What the hell? Frog egg. You're them over. Careful on those those rocks there. Oh, little tabby cat. Oh, little kitty cats. Oh, Grenade. Remember, some of us still want what's best for Appalachia. Hello there, stranger. Where'd you come ambling in from? Vault 76. One of those vault dwellers, are you? I've heard tell of your kind. Solved a lot of problems. And caused a lot of problems, from what I hear. You wouldn't happen to be one of the problem solving kind, would you? I could use one of those right about now. Hey, Can I get you anything? Oh, excuse me. Let me introduce myself. Name's Lane Platt. I'm with the Responders. We're a band of self-titled do-gooders around these parts. Appalachia's filling up fast, and we're trying to keep everyone hale and healthy and off each other's throats. A noble goal? I like to think so. It gives me hope that we can one day right all the wrongs in this world. Now, there's a lot going on in this neck of the woods, more than I can tackle myself. You got ferocious beasts roaming the forest, creepy cult moving into the caves, and all manner of people about ready to go to war with one another. All that is to say, I could use a hand, and I'd be willing to pay you for yours. What do you think? Are you holding up? I'd love to help. What? That is just terrific. Thank you a thousand times over. What do I have for you today? A forest is a dangerous place. Not compared to other regions, mind you, but let's not lose sight of the facts. To make it safer for new settlements, we've been clearing out dangerous critters and using the meat to feed people in need. 
If you could go retrieve the meat from our traps, I will happily compensate you. Okay. Pay me some caps. Get started I appreciate now. your help. Stay safe out there. We'll do, Lane. <laughs> that leveled me. All right, let's do that. Real oh no, no, we won't. More bees. More bees. Survived all this time in Vault 76. Dies to bees. Wouldn't that be a sad way to go? Let's level up. Let's go ahead and buy another one of these. And do that. And I'm not gonna put in it put it in to the perk position yet because I wanna get it all the way to its max rank. So we're gonna wait a level. Let's do this daily. Fresh meat. It's fresh. Investigate the corpse. See, what I love and sometimes hate about Fallout is it is great and terrible for people with ADHD. Because you will... Ooh, what's this? Oh, what's this? Let's go on a main quest. No, let's go do this. And let's do a little bit of the main quest. No, nope, no, nope. over here. Let's do this. It's it's a battle. Let's go to this other trap. I will say, I in terms of foliage and just the look of the game Fallout 76 is my favorite um, I made him leave um, uh oh we got a wolf that uh I'm gonna find out. Okay, the next one. Collect fresh meat from the final trap. And fresh meat has been collected. Hello, Lane. You're back. You've recovered the meat from our traps. Just what I wanted to hear. On behalf of the responders, I can't thank you enough. You helped us make progress toward a more peaceful world. I sure wish I could say that's all the help I needed, but the work never ends. If you're in the neighborhood again sometime, I will always welcome more of your help. Day in the meantime, though, here's your payment. Have a good day now. All right. Mess with me, man. Not, not me and my machete. This is house.
There goes his head. So satisfying doing that with the machete. There's the cat. Cheswick too. Aww. What you doing, little guy? <laughs> it looks like I'm about to kill it. That's awful. The wayward. Opening soon. Sounds like they're already open. Alright, we have arrived at the wayward. Lady, I will paint the walls with you if you don't tell me uh -oh. where Crane. Honey, you picked the wrong time to get a drink. What are you? Hey, who the hell are you? Uh. Whoa, None whoa, what's going on business. here? What's going on is that this one seems to think I know where this big treasure is, and that I'm building my new bar out of refuse for fun. Lady, this is your last warning. Our crew is getting that treasure. And I will happily send you both to the great goddamn beyond if you don't start explaining where I can find what's ours. Uh... Treasure's our crew's business, not yours. And unless I start getting answers right now, I'm gonna start shooting people. Uh... Suit Don't yourself. Worry, I'll make it quick. I told you it was going to end badly. Now I'm hoping you're here to have a drink and play nice. I've had a gun pointed at me more than enough for one day. I'm here to be nice. Huh. Well, not exactly the introduction to the wayward I would have hoped for. Well, sorry about that, darling. First round's on me. Name's Duchess. There's something I could do for you. What was that all about? He said something about a treasure? Your guess is as good as mine, sweetheart. He busted in here saying I needed to turn over the location of some fellow named Crane, who I guess I must have served at some point or another. Since then, a steady stream of miscreants has been making my life irritating. Not exactly good for a budding business. You looking for help dealing with these slugs? Now that you mention it, I could use an extra pair of hands. See? That boy you put down. He's not the first of his crew to roll in here. But I want him to be the last. Normally, I'd send my people out to clean house. But my muscles run off, so I don't have the bodies to spare right now. But I'm willing to pay good money if you put an end to this for me. So, what do you say? Okay, I'll help you. That's what I was hoping. So, the details. Now, each of these boys came in asking after Crane. I'm thinking we can make that work for us. How would you grab the attention of a bunch of single-minded thugs? Um... <laughs> you want me to pretend to be Crane, don't well. you? Aren't you a smart cookie? And I think I know just how to do it. Just give me one second.
So what I have chicken scratched together here for you is the schematic for one custom-made Crane Treasure Hunting Inc. sign. If I didn't butcher the plans too bad, it's got a little system built in that'll make sending out an advertisement and getting this gang's attention a snap. You just need to build it, use the tape it spits out to tell the world you're open for business, and then convince any punks that show up to tell you where their boss is hiding. They did teach you all how to build from schematics up in that vault of yours, didn't they? Yes, I know That's how to build from schematics. Hey, if you need a refresher, good old Morty Mort can help you out. What are you on about, Mordecai? Hey, no, nah, I'm not bragging or anything. But well, I've got some tapes that cover that very subject. Oh, Mort, not the tapes. Well, you find yourself wanting a refresher? Talk to Mort. Of course, you're gonna need materials, but we should have enough lying around to cover you there. Get you together a little care package. Throw some rations in there, too, so you don't starve on me. And so you know, you might have to break some of this scrap down for parts. But I can spot you some workbench materials, too, since you're doing me such a big one. Who knows? Maybe you'll learn something while you do it. Maybe. Now, you ready to get this show on the road? I did want to ask, you haven't seen the Overseer of Vault 76, have you? Overseer, huh? So you must be the one. <laughs> no, I haven't seen her. But I have heard her. My people found a tape just on the other side of the road that it seems she left behind for one of her dwellers. Though it's a bit out of date now. Maybe it was waiting there for you. Happy to give it to you. So long as you're still willing to help us. Absolutely. Let's do this. Hot dog. Be good to have those dolts off our back at long last. Just make sure once you find out where they're hiding, that their leader gets the message. The wayward gets left alone. And here, that overseer tape. Sounds like she set up that camp across the way so her people could get some practice in self-reliance. Probably worth looking into if you think you could use a refresher. Level four. That's it for this video. Leave a like, subscribe, comment, and next video, we're going to dive deeper into Fallout 76. So, catch you then. Take care, guys.